for another wave of protests. Haryana police is taking proactive measures to secure state and city borders, deploying 50 companies of paramilitary forces alongside police personnel. The aim is to prevent farmers from reaching Delhi NCR, mirroring lessons learned from the year-long farmers' agitation on Delhi's borders in 2020-21. to On Thursday, farmers from Uttar Pradesh staged a sit-in demonstration on the Noida Greater Noida Expressway after their protest march towards Delhi was blocked by the police. Several farmer associations, particularly in Ambala, have called for another protest on February 13th, demanding a law guaranteeing minimum support price or MSP. Haryana Police Chief Shatrujit Kapoor held a meeting with top officers to review law and order preparations. A senior police officer emphasized collaboration with the Army, Railway Engineers and the National Highways Authority of India or NHAI to create barricades deemed impenetrable even by armoured vehicles or tractors, ensuring the safety of both protesters and security personnel. In a bid to address the farmers' demands, three union ministers arrived in Chandigarh to meet representatives from various farmer groups in Punjab and Haryana. The farmers, planning a march to Delhi on February 13th, seek assurances on issues such as MSP for all crops, a waiver of farmer debt, jobs for families of deceased farmers and the withdrawal of criminal cases against protesters. The Haryana government, anticipating the protest march, has heightened security at its borders with Punjab, with security forces on high alert. The ministers, including Piyush Goyal, Arjun Munda and Nityanand Rai, engaged in discussions with Punjab Chief Minister Bhagwant Man and representatives from the Kisan Mazdoor Sangharsh Committee and Bharatiya Kisan Union or BKU factions. Earlier, the protest by various pharmacist groups brought traffic to a standstill on Delhi's border with Uttar Pradesh. The agitation, calling for attention to pharmacist demands, was eventually called off after assurances from the Uttar Pradesh government and Noida authority, pledging to address the pharmacist concerns by forming a panel. As the tension escalates, the Haryana state government has requested the deployment of 64 companies of paramilitary forces from the centre to handle potential law and order issues during the upcoming march. The Ambala district administration has imposed prohibitory orders anticipating potential unrest. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.